Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do a reading for Gemini. This is for Gemini, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus, and this is for the week of January 25th through the 31st. Keep in mind that the timing is still fluid, and not every reading is for you. So what do we have for Gemini, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus for the week of January 25th through the 31st? What do we have for Gemini? One card, please. Temperance. Temperance is a card of timing. It is a card of patience, balance, going with the flow, uh, an exchange, exchanging one thing for something better. Everything happens for a reason. This is a card of purpose. So I do believe that you are going to be going through a big change this week. You are evolving. You're not the same person that you used to be. Um, yeah, you're changing. You're evolving. All right. Um, your need to be grounded, but you need to be fluid. I feel like you're on another path. You're going down another path. You are uh, doing whatever it takes to create harmony in your life. So this is a week of blending to create harmony. I feel like you've learned a lesson, you know, a higher lesson. And now it's all about, you know, just going with the flow and doing whatever you have to do to have peace and harmony in your life. So that is what the focus is this week. managing your feelings, you know, um, definitely, you know, this comes after the death card. So there may be an ending that has, ex that has happened or is, you know, I feel like it has just recently happened that, you know, the death is a profound change. Now this is healing after an ending. So you're going to be, this is a time of healing for you and accepting and allowing shall take those Gemini skull hidden secrets can harm you gavel involvement with the law so you may be dealing with the law there could be some secrets here that you know because you have somebody working is against you I feel like um, Whatever is happening, everything happens for a reason. So, yeah, everything ha you're changing, you're evolving. So what do we have for Gemini? What do we have for Gemini? King of Wands. Now, the King of Wands is somebody that um, takes action, is given to take action. You could be dealing with a Sagittarius. We also have Aries and Leo here, but this is somebody that is very decisive, makes a decision, is determined, strong, courageous, um, action-oriented. So be strong during this change. You're going to be going through some sort of change. You're going to need to be strong. And remain focused. Try to remain focused. Alright, so we have the Five of Swords and the Knight of Cups. So the Five of Swords is about power struggle, struggling. Uh, feeling defeated, you know, somebody may be fighting with you. They could be fighting with you. They could be acting on their feelings. You could be dealing with a serious battle here. You could be dealing with a water sign, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. You could also be dealing with an air sign, or did I say air sign? I meant, well, we could, now that I said it, an air sign, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. But I was going to say fire, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. I feel like you are, have a lot of abundance. I feel like you're very self-sufficient. You have a lot to offer. I feel like you should be enjoying your life. You're trying to focus on enjoying your life. You may not be aware of something. You know, somebody has some sort of secrets and I feel like the secrets are going to be revealed you do have somebody that has some secrets about you and I feel like they're gonna they're gonna try to cause some trouble but I feel like you're in a position of authority I feel like you're in a position of power I feel like you have um, some sort of I feel like you have some sort of competition here um, you're definitely going to be dealing with somebody who wants to fight with you by the looks of things with the five of swords that's a power struggle 
um, a battle of some sort. You could be dealing with somebody that has a very big ego. Um, this person doesn't care who they hurt. They just like to be in control. You could be dealing with somebody that is very power hungry. I do think that there's going to there's be a lot of feelings. You're going to be experiencing a lot of feelings. We could have somebody here that has some hurt feelings. They are hurt and their pride has been hurt, you know, so they're acting on their feelings. Um, Page of Pentacles. Now, Page of Pentacles is an opportunity. Now, Taurus had this too. So you have an opportunity right in your hands right now. You're in control. You are in control. You are in a position of authority. You are, but you do have somebody here that is, it's almost like they want to defeat you. Um, anyhow, the Page of Pentacles is an opportunity to go laying a new foundation, starting from scratch. It's not going to be easy. You, you Now, if you add this, it equals a Ten of Pentacles. So I feel like you are building a new foundation. I feel like you are very capable. You are very strong. You have all the... Uh, resources and I don't need the magician to see that you do have the resources to be successful I think that you're headed towards um, stability you know security something permanent but you do you are gonna have you are gonna be dealing with some sort of power struggle this week or somebody that is um, battling with you okay be prepared get prepared for some sort of battle um, there is some secrets that are going to be revealed. Um, you may have to spend some money. You may have to spend some money um, this week. But I do see you going down a new path that is going to lead to permanent stability. You are headed towards long-term stability right here. Your hard work is paying off or is going to pay off in some way. You could be dealing with a liar, so I think that you need to be careful. I think that you have a liar here, a master manip manipulator. I do feel like you have a master manipulator here that is uh, hmm, experiencing some struggles. You're dealing with somebody that is struggling, and I don't, I don't know if that is you. I mean, the Nine of Wands is is a wounded warrior, so I feel like we have somebody here that is wounded. They've been hurt. They've been hurt, and I feel like they're going to challenge you in some way. I feel like you're going to have to be extremely strong this week. Hope, be strong. Do not show any weakness at all. Show no weakness. You have come a long, long, long way. I feel like... Uh, you know, you may, you may, you may feel like you're on edge. You know, you may be weary. You may feel like, you know, uh, you're not going to go where you're going, but you are going to go where you're going. You know, you are going to get there. You, you may be experiencing some, some fear. You may be experiencing some fear, but don't have any fear. Do not have any fear. I feel like you need to, uh, Remember how far you've come and do not lose your determination and protect yourself. I feel like you do need to protect yourself. I feel like you're going to be facing some challenges this week with somebody that is uh, very secretive. I think you've got somebody here that is, they may be scheming against you. They're very, very secretive. They're working behind the scenes. They're not very knowledgeable. They're a liar. You're dealing with somebody that's a liar. And I feel like... Um, whoever you're dealing with, uh, you're still, you're, I feel like this person is, let's see what's going to happen with this person that is lying. I think, I think that they're, 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 you're going to be tested this week by this person. Ah, not successful. So somebody's not going to be successful. The death card reversed. You're headed towards happiness. Okay. This is contentment. Something to celebrate. This is like a new home. Something like that. This death card reversed is um, a disaster of some sort. Or destruction. This holding on is getting old. Something is going, getting old. We have somebody here that is very, very secretive. And I feel like they're going to challenge you in some way. But they're not going to be successful. They're, they're, it's getting old. This is old. This is getting old. And they may, they may be told that. They may be told that, you know what, this, this fighting is getting old. And maybe that's how you're feeling. This fighting is getting old. It's, it is. It's getting, it's old. You know, and this could be a ruler. 
this could be a ruler, could be a judge, I don't know, somebody in a position of authority that actually tells somebody, you know what, you don't have the resources. And I feel like you have the resources, but you're dealing with somebody else that doesn't. So I feel like this is getting old. I feel like something is getting, the fighting is getting old. You know, and who wants to deal with that? You know, it's almost like a public embarrassment. So I feel like whoever you're dealing with is going to be embarrassed. You know, this is just, just let it go. It's time to let it go. It's time to evolve. It's time to go with the flow and to accept and allow, accept and allow things to happen as they should. So, you know, I feel like, um, this is about blending to create harmony, making changes to create balance and harmony in your life. And I feel like you are determined to create balance and harmony in your life, you know, to let go of the strife. But I feel like you do have somebody here that, you know, is going to challenge you. But I feel like you're going to win. I feel like you're going to win in, in every way because you have the resources. You have, you've proved yourself. I feel like you have proved yourself. I feel like you are very self-sufficient. You're a hard worker, you know. Um, five of Swords. Now, the Five of Swords is some sort of defeated, emotional, emotional defeat here. Acting on feelings. You have somebody that is very unpredictable that I don't, I think you can't trust this person. You have an untrustworthy individual around you that is very, very manipulative. But I do see that you're going down a new path. Do not let fear hold you back. Be confident in your in the changes that you are making. You are making the right changes. Now, the Four of Wands is, is, is happiness, contentment, a gathering, a celebration, celebrating something, a new foundation. So I, I do believe that you um, have a lot to celebrate. There's something to celebrate here. You may be leaving somebody behind, you know, going your own way. Maybe that's what you need to do to create harmony in your life. You may be fearful of some things, but don't let fear get in the way. Be strong. Hold your head up high. Keep going in the direction that you're going. It's not easy, but you have the stability and the security that is needed to be successful. Hidden secrets. There's definitely some hidden secrets here. Moon, yes, yeah, secrets. Secrets that are going to be revealed. So there's secrets being revealed this week. And it could be about another person. It could be. It could be about, a, you could be dealing with a water sign. Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, or Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, there, or somebody. Yeah, Taurus, Virgo. There could be some secrets that are revealed this week. There is going to be some secrets that are revealed this week. Page of Wands reversed. Now the Page of Wands reversed is a setback of some sort. This is somebody who who doesn't have any anything good to say. We have somebody that is um, always trying to bring other people down, and I feel like there's going to be a level of confusion and indecision here. But I do see you going down a new path. I do with that page of Pentacles. You're going to be receiving an opportunity. You are. You're going to be receiving an opportunity that you asked for. You manifested this. So the answer, you're going to get what you wanted, but you may have to, or somebody, there's something that may have to come out first. 
you know, and it could lead to, you know, somebody else's loss, you know, somebody could lose something of big value because, I don't know, it feels like there's some sort of battle here where secrets get revealed, emotions go all over the place, you know, it's very emotional time. I feel like with that page of wands reverse, it's not good news. You know, you could be dealing with somebody that is very, very immature, you know, that is unreliable, that is negative, that, uh, you know, makes excuses and procrastinates and doesn't have any focus that presents themselves as somebody that is stable, you know, and they get made a fool out of, you know, because the page of wands reversed is foolish. So, hmm, interesting. So, yeah, I do feel like there is some sort of secrets that are going to be revealed this week. But I think that you're going to be have to manage your feelings and probably, you know, deal with them and hold your head up high and be strong and show your valor, show your nobility, show your stability in your nobility, in your you know, your strength, you're going to have to show your strength, you're going to have to prove your, you know, oh, wow, that nine of pentacles is a self-sufficient, self-reliant, stable, solid individual who has worked hard to obtain success and they've done it all on their own. Prove your character. You know, you may have to prove your character this week, but you will prevail with that page of pentacles. That is, that is a yes, a yes. You will be going down this path. There could be somebody that may try to fight you, but they will be made a fool out of, and they could lose something of huge value because they do. It may have something to do with a child. Maybe it's a, I don't know if it's a little heel. Or, I don't know where Leo comes from, but um, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn as well. Anyhow, and maybe it's you telling secrets. You may have to reveal some secrets this week. Maybe you got you to gotta do whatever you got to do to protect yourself. I feel like you do have to protect yourself and you have to protect, you know, your investment. So if you have to reveal something, you know, to protect your investment, then I suggest you do it. You got to do what you do, got to do to have balance and harmony in your life. And if there's people that are trying to fight you and, you know, you've been playing the nice guy, you might have to just let everybody hear it, hear the truth. You know? So anyway, I do feel like you're going to be facing some opposition this week. And it is getting old. This opposition is absolutely getting old. There's a chance, you know, somebody, you're dealing with somebody that can either walk away or they can fight. You know, I feel like it's about love. I mean, the page of, I mean, the Knight of Pentacles is about love. What's, what's best is love. What matters most is love. Acting on love. So anyway, I feel like this week, you are going to need to manage your feelings because you're going to be experiencing some sort of change you're going through some sort of change there could be somebody you could be dealing with an individual that you know is very negative this is a negative nelly that likes to be in control you know very power hungry with the five of swords egotistical is acting on their feelings you know is not seeing things clearly you know this is somebody that is delusional of some sort you know they 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 want their power they want control they want ego they're not making a heartfelt decision you know and you may you may have to uh reveal some things to you know whoever it is that you need to reveal them to good luck <laughs>